The method allows the nanoscale studies of bacteria. It provides us a detailed insight into the chemical alterations in antimicrobial resistance. Therefore, it can contribute to our understanding of AMR and drug development. Nanoscale size of bacteria significantly limits um, the available research tools capable of probing their chemistry. AFMIR allows us to do it in a non-destructive, observer-independent manner, even on a subcellular level. By providing an insight into the antimicrobial resistance, the method can help to identify and test molecular targets for new antimicrobials. In addition to bacteria, AFMIR can probe a range of cells, tissues and even viruses. To prepare a sample for AFMIR imaging, after growing the bacteria of interest on the appropriate medium under the appropriate culture conditions, use a sterile loop to carefully pick bacteria from the top of the colonies for transfer to a glass tube. Add one milliliter of ultra-pure water to the tube and vortex for one to two minutes until the collected bacterial pellet is no longer visible at the bottom of the tube. Estimate the rough turbidity of the solution by visual comparison between the prepared solution and McFarland standards. If the turbidity of the bacterial suspension appears to be very low, continue to add more bacteria and to vortex until the rough turbidity of the solution is comparable to the 0.5 and 1 McFarland standards. Pellet the bacteria by centrifugation and carefully aspirate the supernatant with a pipette. Resuspend bacterial cell pellet in one milliliter of ultra-pure water with 